I grew up around horses in Puerto Rico in an area where there were no veterinarians around. And it was basically that frustration that motivated me to become a veterinarian since, since I was little and provide care for the horses. On a typical day, uh, I can do anything from very simple uh, veterinary things like vaccinations and deworming horses, taking care of the horse's teeth. I'm a board certified surgeon. Uh, we as surgeons can do any type of surgery on a horse. What I enjoy the most about equine medicine is doing lameness exams because while I'm doing lameness exams, I'm trying to solve a puzzle. It's just like CSI on TV, we try to play detectives. I have a patient here who can't talk and she can't tell me where it hurts. So for me, it's a challenge to try to find out where it hurts. I have to do all kinds of diagnostic procedures like doing nerve blocks, flexing the limbs, trying to see where she hurts. Then I can find out what's the best treatment for her. When I was a kid growing in Puerto Rico, I honestly had a lot of people that would try to discourage me into going into this profession because it was, um, first I didn't know English back then and it was too hard. You had to study too many years and you'd have to go to the United States speaking English. But I wanted to be a veterinarian so badly and none of those barriers would stop me from achieving my goals.